Hey y'all, it's uh, Sunday evening, so that's usually the day that I do my Gray's Writing Life for YouTube update. So yeah, I'm gonna do that now. So let's see, let's get right into it. Um, baking tomorrow is uh, pumpkin, because it's October, and we tend to do pumpkin around Halloween anyways. I'll probably start using my scary molds that I have, that we do for like the month. <laughs> hey, I gotta remember to do that, I gotta pull those out tomorrow. And, uh, yeah, so I want to be pumpkin. Um, awesome. Writing, um, is going. Um, Esme's and Jordan's short story for Crimson Rose. Well, it's not, it's kind of a short story. I don't know, 20,000 words. I guess it's a short story. Short-ish story. Novella, whatever. Is, um, I'm going. Uh, I've reached about 8,300 into it, and I got about 11,000 left to do. So, well, if I do my 2K... Um, this week I'll be down to about 9,000 left, so I get, uh, 7, 5, 3. It'll be about, yeah, probably the end of October I'll have it finished. And I'm getting closer to reaching my 100,000 words for the for the year. Um, I'm a little over 80,000 already, so... I don't think I'll make it with the, with the story. I probably have to add something else, but we'll see what... I guess I'll see what happens. But yeah, my goal was to write a um, hundred thousand words this year, so I gave myself homework, <laughs> basically writing a lot of essays. <laughs> ah, the fun times of being a writer—you give yourself own, your own homework, I guess. Um, I just talked to the cover designer for the second story for Storm Chasers, and she's gonna get that uh, made for me. I sent her some pictures, and if she doesn't like those pictures, she said I told her that she can go find some for herself and. So once I get that back, probably, um, I think she said it was to be around the 4th. Uh, I'll probably publish it this, this upcoming Sunday and get that out of the way. And then I'll save up some more money and then do another cover for the story for my mailing list and revive that thing. Or maybe I'll just wait till next year because there's not that much left of the year. And I only have like one more story for the year, so we'll see what happens. But yeah, I'm going to get that mailing list, uh, hopefully revived. And I gotta get another cover made to do, um certain uh marketing things that you use for your mailing list because um uh, like book funnel and stuff like that they want uh an image so yeah i gotta get that done um other than that uh it's a new month i haven't really made any money but uh the, the you know the, about the 20 bucks i made last month um was great because i'm not really doing any marketing and so it's just my 20 bucks uh, except for, you know, my free marketing, posting my images up on Twitter, uh, TikTok, Instagram, threads, Pinterest, you know, all that stuff. So, yeah, it doesn't, uh, I don't really make much money on my stories, but, you know, the other, the little bit of money that I make every month is, you know, an extra bit. Moving on from that, uh, deliveries this week, which is my main source of income, is uh, going to do uh, tomorrow night, and then it'll be Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday afternoons and evenings this week. To make, you know, about my 3 to 350 that I normally make, which is nice. Um, I'm on par to probably make about the 17000 that I made last year, which is for me because I don't uh, have an apartment or anything. It's just paying my car off and taking care of phone bills and insurance. That's still quite a bit of money that I can uh, save up and put wherever. So, yeah, that's... Uh, I need... Um, Probably a little bit over 2000 left to, to make what I made last year. Granted, last year I mostly did it just doing dinners, but, you know, still if I can make $17,000 um, for the year, that would be awesome. Because it gives me uh, money to play with and pay for my car and put money away into uh, my savings account or the market or, you know, the things that I've been doing for the last year. So, yeah, that's uh, ongoing. Um... Winter's coming up, though, and I don't quite know how many days we'll be able to go out in, like, November and December and January and February. But it'll be what I worry about when the time comes. I, a lot of the reports for New York say that we're not going to get that much snow, but, you know, New York still gets snow. So, well, I guess I'll have to see. Um, moving on from that, uh, my investments um, are down a lot this week because of the Fed rate and the government threatening to shut down at one point which they passed over the weekend. So hopefully maybe uh, my market, or my account will go back up a little bit. But yeah, I'm down about 600 bucks again. 
Um, all total, though, I have over a little bit over 8,400 invested into my two stocks for uh, VTI and SHED. And Monday, my 40 bucks will go in, so I did my 2020 split as usual. Um, Acorns is a little bit over 2,000. And I did my uh, five dollars or ten dollars a week that I put in there, but I've been giving that a little bit of extra money into my IRA part, so I give that an extra ten dollars. So that's uh, slowly growing. Um, I don't know if uh, I don't really want to put a lot into that because I don't know where the future will be, but you know it'll be there and it'll grow, and that's cool. And then I put my. Uh, about eleven dollars away into my savings account because the dividend came in to match, uh, you know, the, the, about the twenty-five that I put in at the end of the month. So yeah, that's got a little bit over. Um, I think it's about thirty-eight hundred now. So I probably will cut that off maybe when I get to about five thousand. I don't know. We'll see. But it'll take me to next year most likely. And then other than that, I just have my money in my uh, checking account that I use lately for other things. Um, when I sold my role-playing books, I got quite a bit. So, um, And then my car is down to about 8400 and I have the rest of the money for um, October. So I'm going to give it like $300 on my principal, and then I'll do the 375 at the end, because uh, I just did the payment yesterday. So it was actually like 400 so by the end of uh, November, that'll be down to about 7,000-something. And by the end of the year, it'll be down to 6,000-something. So early next year, um, about six months, give or take, depending on what I want to do, it'll be paid off. So that'll be nice because it'll be about a year, about six months earlier than I planned. And then other than that, i um, just been going back to do some reading. I'm tired of my gaming. So yeah, I've been going back to my books because I haven't been reading for about two weeks, two or three weeks, actually. And then tomorrow night will be um, my walk, and hopefully on Friday too, but it's going to get like really cold by the end of the week. Um, we're going to go from like 80 to 40 in like two or three days. So we'll see what happens by the end of the week, and they are predicting rain. So, And then uh, tonight will be uh, yoga, and then the same thing on Wednesday to stretch my back and my incision and scar and my knees and ankles and all that stuff that hurts that's you know old and in pain. So, yeah, I guess uh, that's about it right now. Um, you know, things are just progressing, and I'm trying to finish up uh, different projects and think about what I'm going to do in the future. So, that's, I guess, that, yeah, that's it. So, this is getting a little longer, and I, if you made it this far, um, awesome, you know. And just um, let me know how things are going with you. I don't get really many comments on my longer videos. Not that many people watch them. But my shirts do, so especially on TikTok. So I will uh, see you next week.